Hey, and welcome back to our last presentation of this series. This is video number eight, and I just wanted to recap what we should have been sharing with each other. The purpose of this video series was to assist those that struggle with locating work or for those that are transitioning to a near, new career path to have an easier transition with utilizing the methods that I have seen benefit so many people. There again, I just want to recap that I shared with you the methods that work best, and these are not in any particular order, but I have shared with you how utilizing a self-assessment, and there again, using this periodically throughout your career, can really help you identify who you are, what you need, what you want, and what you're actually looking for in a new career. And then job coaching and mentoring, I shared with you the importance of that as well. I hope that you have been able to locate someone that would uh, make a good mentor for you. If not, you can reach out and I would be happy to be your job coach and I can work with you side by side and, and assist you along your career path. And then I hope that you are out there networking. I know that this is, uh, you know, different times that we're living in, but there are lots of networking opportunities available out there to you. So I hope that you're doing that. I hope that you are looking at this time in your life that when you're transitioning as a time that you need to be planning because locating work is actually considered work or a job and you need to really look at it that way. So I hope that you have a plan in place and that you are looking at that list of transferable skills that you have. Now I would like to share with you this next slide because this really just puts it all together. This is one of my favorite quotes. And I'm not just sharing it with you just because it's one of my favorites, but it's what I want to wish for everyone that has gone through this series and this course. So never settle for less than you want or that you deserve and never overlook what you already have. Being a job coach, I see so many people every day that come to me being so frustrated with trying to look for work and just down and out because it's such a tedious, time-consuming task, but it's such a necessary one if we want to get back out there in that playing field. But so many come to me and they overlook what they already have. And I hope now that you will start to look in that mirror and look at what you can offer that next employer. And don't settle for less, that's not necessary. There are jobs out there and there's lots of opportunities for you to find the career path that will speak to you and find your passion. So I hope you will carry this quote along with you, just as I have done throughout my career. Again, I want to say thank you. My name is Teresa Claybrook, and I've enjoyed being your host. And if I can help you out in any way, please let me know. Before I leave, I wanted to share with you that I have posted some resources and now so that you can actually take the quiz. And I do want to go ahead and say one more time, thank you. And if you know of anyone that can benefit from these five methods of transitioning your career, I hope you will pass the information along and share this information with your friends. Thank you and have a great day.